one of my goals is to make you feel as comfortable as possible with having a joint replacement. And I think that starts by making sure that you feel like you have all the information you need about your diagnosis and your treatment, and then talking to you about what we need to do to have you ready for surgery and what's going to happen afterwards. A hip or knee replacement consists of making an incision to expose the joint, removing the arthritic bone, and replacing it with a combination of metal, plastic, and ceramic. The typical operation could take anywhere from an hour to an hour and a half, slightly longer or shorter depending on the complexity of the procedure. At the end, we close up the skin with dissolvable stitches, some glue, and a waterproof dressing. In preparation for surgery, we'll do a number of things to make sure that someone is as tuned up as possible. That includes labs, a chest x-ray, an EKG, and frequently a visit to their primary care doctor and or any specialists that they might see. In preparation for surgery, I encourage patients to be as active as they can be, as well as to eat as healthy as they can. A successful joint replacement is very much dependent on the recovery process, and it takes a lot of ownership on the patient's side for that to happen, to go to physical therapy, to talk to me if they're having difficulty with pain control, and to come and visit with me so that I can help with that process. One of the things that's changed over time is how quickly we get people up and moving. The majority of people now can go home from a joint replacement the same day they have it done. We get people up and walking within hours of surgery, whether it's a hip replacement, a knee replacement, or a partial knee replacement. And that translates forward into faster recovery at every level. Many people are driving a car by two weeks after surgery, and many people are back working anywhere from two weeks to six weeks after surgery, depending on the level of physical fitness required for their job. Thank you.